Welcome to another episode of 5 Minutes Book Summary. Today we are going to explore the book, The Elephant in the Brain, by Kevin Simler and Robin Hansen. The book explores the hidden motives behind human behavior. The authors argue that we often deceive ourselves about our true intentions and instead act in ways that serve our selfish interests. The book begins by exploring the concept of the elephant in the room, the thing that everyone knows is there but nobody wants to acknowledge. The authors use this metaphor to describe the hidden motives that drive human behavior. They argue that people often have a hidden agenda for their actions, and that these agendas can be quite different from what they say they're doing. One of the key themes of the book is that people are often more interested in signaling their virtues to others than in actually achieving results. For example, the authors argue that people often go to college not so much to learn, but to signal their intelligence and ambition to others. They also discuss how charitable giving is often motivated by a desire to signal one's generosity and altruism. Another example the authors explore is in the area of medicine. While we may claim that the primary goal of medical treatment is to improve our health, in reality, there are often other hidden motives at play. Doctors may be more motivated by the desire to protect their reputation or avoid lawsuits than to provide the best possible care to their patients. Another theme of the book is the concept of informational asymmetry, the idea that some people have more information than others, and that this can lead to power imbalances and manipulation. The authors argue that many institutions, such as corporations and governments, are designed to exploit this asymmetry of information for their own benefit. The authors also explore the concept of preference falsification, the idea that people often hide their true preferences in order to conform to social norms. For example, someone might pretend to like a certain type of music because they think it's what their friends expect of them, even if they don't actually enjoy it. The authors argue that this can lead to a lack of diversity and innovation in society, as people are reluctant to express their true preferences. Overall, The Elephant in the Brain is a fascinating exploration of the hidden motives behind human behavior. It challenges us to question our own intentions and consider the possibility that our actions may not always align with our stated beliefs. By shedding light on the ways in which we deceive ourselves, the authors provide a powerful tool for understanding human behavior and improving our decision-making processes.